we're waiting. We're waiting to ask this gentleman a question. Hold on. Today we're on a mission to find your cheapest rig here today. Could you show us the model that is the cheapest one you have? Well, she's she's pulling stuff around now. We're gonna get in trouble. Julie, don't get us kicked out. Would, look, I'm literally, come on, people. I'm, I'm tiny. It's the silver bullet thing, right? I, I'm not allowed to say that, am I, Lawrence? Is it a silver? Is that what they call it? No, that's like a <clears throat> today's show price: one fifty six nine nine five. But this is the cheapest grand designs. Yes. The imagined thirteen um, mess. But we will find the cheapest one here and do a little review for you. He doesn't know, so let's ask an actual person. It makes me wonder. <laughs> Alright, welcome back to Brains and Brits. I am Natalie. And I'm Julie. And you will remember Julie from such episodes as Kelly's Island and <laughs> the Fire Fork 360. Yes. Worth checking out that product. Anyway, we have been dragged back to the RV show today by Lawrence's mum, of all people, because she didn't realise you were allowed to go inside the rigs. <laughs> So, me and Julie have decided to have a little challenge and we're getting some comments, feedback from you guys saying that, you know, actually they want to see some affordable rigs. So we're going to go to some of the uh, brands, I guess, whatever you call it, and find out what is the cheapest rig that they have here today. We've already found a Lance guy. So for the truck campers out here, do you mind me filming you, sir? You go right ahead. Hello, Scott. This is Scott and he is with Lance, if that helps. Today we're on a mission to find your cheapest rig here today. Could you show us the model that is the cheapest one you have? Ooh, I will be happy to, but we don't really make cheap stuff. We no, I'm not saying cheap as in okay. nasty, I'm just saying right. you're, you're most our, affordable. Our, our, less, our less affordable. expensive is right down here. Let's go find it. Stop number one then. We have the 2024 Lance 650. He said something about a truck. It has to be pulled by a three quarter ton truck. I'm glad Julie's listening yes, three because... Quarters, a three quarter ton truck. <laughs> you know me, I'm already forgotten about it. So this one is the MSRP is 55 5 538. What does D and H price mean? Does that mean that would be the sale price? Oh, there's Lawrence. He uh, is here. We got a sale price of for the show of four th forty three thousand nine hundred and ninety nine. Oh, that's what that means. All right. So, still, still, let's go and check it out. It's already been, oh, okay. All right. Dining area. Sleeping area. We have a nice microwave. Small combo shower toilet area. It's cute. It's cute. I'm not sure I'm fitting any Dobermans in here, but no. it's it's all right. I fit a Jack Russell in here. Yeah, perfect for the Jack Russell owners. <laughs> all right. Small terriers, yeah, right. little dogs. Yeah. So there you go, that's a Lance something 650. Already forgotten. Uh, let's move on to the next one. We are in the, well, not, it's not even a Flagstaff section, is it? It's, we're in Camping World. Yes. There's a really cute Doberman there, so I can't help myself. All right, we are going to have a look at what the cheapest Flagstaff is travel trailer. The Flagstaff E Pros that are a little bit smaller than this, it's still a Flagstaff, it's just not a micro light Flagstaff. All right, we're going to stick with the microlight. So this is the 25 FK BS. Yes. The show price today is 42995 and that's from Camping World, correct? Camping World. Yes. Camping World. What rig do you need to pull? So something like this, you can get around with like a F-150, any sort of 1500, Chevy or Ram 1500. Awesome. So, um, so an affordable tow vehicle. Yes. An, an affordable, affordable tow vehicle. Right, let's go check it out. is interesting design so the door kind of separates the front right okay or it is just a door for the toilet oh, that's pass, not pass. a very prime pooping position <laughs> I, pass through bathroom. Yes. I like it all right and then we have an rv queen oh this is cute some storage yeah. <laughs> if i could oh, come right now i don't know how to do it <laughs> there we go nice I love the light colours. I do. I always like the light colours. And uh, yeah, 42 grand. Not bad. Affordable ring. Affordable-ish. 
Let's go find some more. We are now in the grand design section. Uh, Lawrence is already chatting people up over here. Hello. Hello. Yeah. <laughs> well, direct me to the cheapest grand designs rig, sweetheart. <laughs> that one over there. It's 28,000. Let's go check it out. Starting to see why it's only 28 grand. <laughs> it has plastic countertops. The oh, plastic. she's already angry at the plastic, plastic counter countertops. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, only two hobs. Oh, two stove stove tops. Two burners. Two burners. I can't what they call it. Uh, it? There's no <laughs> oven. No, good. I'm I approve. I approve. I approve of no oven. You, you approve. I'm air fryers all the way. <laughs> Whoop. As a cook, I'm like, no, I want my air fryers. <laughs> How am I supposed to make a grand party and all this food in that? Well, if they have nice uh, faucets. <laughs> ah, oh no! Oh, I got dewinterized this stuff in my head. <laughs> um, where the hell's the bed? <laughs> I believe, possibly. <laughs> oh, this is lovely, but oh, hold on. Okay, yeah. Yeah, right. the bed's back there. Okay. I see the mattress. You yeah, have to I mean, fold if it, it down and. If you're just going camping at like a. All the way out to here and. You have no space to do anything. Yes. But this is the cheapest grand designs. Yes. The imagined 13 MS for 28 grand. Yeah. Here's the bed. Oh, well, she's she's pulling stuff around now. We're going to get in trouble. Judy, don't get us kicked out. <laughs> Just want to say thank you, Grand Designs. We finally scored. I finally got my tennis ball and you got a mug. They're amazing people. We love our Grand yeah. Designs team. Team Grand Designs. Obviously, we're Team Grand Design because we have a reflection. Anyway, we're going to go and pretend to uh, own a Jayco now. So, uh, see you there. All right, we're in the Tiffin section now. We know a lot of you uh, of our friends have Tiffins. So, let's go find the, not the cheapest, most affordable Most tiffin. Oh, Lawrence is going to talk on this one. Woo. <laughs> we agreed. I just want to come out and hang, hang out of the show without filming. Natalie can't stay away from it. Right, we are looking at, Natalie even went and asked, that we are looking at the 2024 Tiffin Open Road 32 SA. This is the cheapest Class A that they have. Most affordable. Sorry, this is the most <laughs> affordable Class A that they have. A whopping 195. 995. Let's go check it out. No plastic countertops. <laughs> I would hope not for 200 grand. Yes. It does not have plastic countertops, which is nice. It does have plastic cabinets. Good size refrigerator. Huge. Where's the stove? Stairs for what? Stove. Oh, stove. Uh, class A's typically don't have an oven. Mine did. <laughs> <laughs> All right, but the nice burner. class A's don't have an oven. <laughs> <laughs> they don't bother anymore because of the convection, do they? All right, well, let's go check out the bedroom. Ooh, that's king. That's the king. TV. Bathroom? With the pastor bathroom. Oh, yes. Pastor bathroom. Decent sized shower. Yep. Yeah. Crimped up in there. That is not a prime poop position. I'm just no. stealing Matt's uh, yeah. <laughs> Matt's half of his reviews here, but now I see it. Now I see it, Matt. Every time I'm looking at a toilet, I'm like, yeah, that's not a prime pooping position. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he here today? Where is he? He should be here, yeah, over at the uh, General RV. General General yeah. General yeah. RV's everywhere. Well, that's true. I think he has a little tent somewhere. Yeah. Does this come down? Oh yeah, yes. it's yeah. Yeah. down. I see it there. This one's down here. Huh? Yeah, it's very That's fast. Nice. It's extremely fast. Cute. All right, we're in the absolutely not affordable, affordable section now. The D. I like the D. <laughs> Natalie <laughs> loves the D. <laughs> Let's go find the most affordable D suite. D suite. I have met the world's worst Lazy Days employee. I'm joking, he's not employed by them. 
Here is our good friend from Wandering Local. How's it going? I have the swag. <laughs> yes, that's true. We're doing a meet and greet here, and uh, Lazy Days is sponsoring our content. Um, but if you were to honestly ask me about the rig behind me, I could not tell you. I would just tell you that it's uh, it's awesome, and you should come check it out. <laughs> come check it out. But we will find the cheapest one here and do a little review for you. He doesn't know, so let's ask an actual person. <laughs> All right, getting back to business here. Gosh, shenanigans. Nice. We have found the cheapest DRV mobile suite. So this is a 2024 36 RSSB3. Today's show price, 156,995. Let's go check it out. You know, for the price, this isn't bad. Oh, this is pretty nice. Dude. I love the sink. Full oven, full, full house. Oven and Sorry, full burners. burners. I'll get used to it. <laughs> nice microwave. This massive huge. fridge. Huge. Woo! Lots of floor space here. Oh, oh, uh, oh! We could lay down floor right vents. Floor vents. It's got floor vents. We don't like floor vents. We don't like floor vents. It attracts vents. rubbish. Look, it's already dirt yeah. in there, and it catches the dog's toenails. Yes. Rips their toenail off. Yes. They need to fix that. Need to fix that. Come on, DRV. Yeah. <laughs> nice big windows nice big, though. Nice big TV. Oh, I like Lots this. of seating around the TV. Oh look, it's like a, oh okay, so the entrance is on the left. That's yeah. strange. Sorry okay. sir. <laughs> so, I like it though. Because it, it, it keeps it away. Oh, look at this. This is definitely a king. Oh, it's got a safe, built-in safe. This could fit like four of you. Yeah. <laughs> We're gonna do that now. We're gonna just <laughs> talk about oh, gonna lie four Julies. <laughs> How many, what size is the bed? It's, it's, it's four Julie size. It's four Julies <laughs> and six Jack Russells. <laughs> and it's bathroom? No, fake cabinets. Oh, oh. That's weird, is it it's not a, oh, oh, it's yeah, a, it oh, it's washer dryer. That's washer right. dryer. Sweet. All right. I could just sell my house and live in this. Right. One five six. That's that's really not bad. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Ooh, excuse me. Good pooping that position. Dishwasher. <gasps> dishwasher. Dishwasher. Those dirty. They've officially used. <laughs> <laughs> I like it. Oh, it's got winterizing stuff in it. Yep. I just did the same. Oh, they oh, is oh, approximately oh, ten oh, julies. Oh, <laughs> It's our new unit of measurement. How many Julies can we fit in the basement? <laughs> All right, next up, we're gonna feature the Coachman 2024 Clipper 12, 120, that, I can't, one, two, zero, 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 rock. 15, 999, cheap, affordable, affordable. 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 Look how tiny. Yeah. I don't even have to stand back. Sit outside. We have the pull down bed. This fits approximately two Julies. Two Julies and a couple of Jack Russells. <laughs> and over here we have a seating area. There's. Uh, oh, this is an interesting way to have air conditioning. Why? 1970s called what? that. Well, yeah. <laughs> Okay, I will also and say like hear, I'm not a very tall person and yes, this is a, I'm five two. You ain't getting in here if you're any bigger than what are you? No. Four and five four? Toity, right outside your door. Yeah, you could open the door. You can say poop and watch. No Not a luxury pooper. Shower? No, you just Where's have here here is your, your bathroom doorway. <laughs> um, no shower. No nope. It's uh interesting. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, it's 15 grand. Not terrible. But I would, li I'm literally, come on, people. I'm, I'm tiny. All right, so this is the Solus Pocket 36B new. And we're priced at 115,945 show price today. So let's go and have a nosy. See how many Julies it fits. <laughs> well, this isn't going to fit very many Julies or Jacks. <laughs> Yeah, this is the bed. Wow. It folds out, so maybe two, le two Julies <laughs> and a Jack, or yeah. Julie and a couple Jacks. One Julie and a couple Jacks. And then she said there was a pull-out porta potty on this one. Where do we think that is? Oh, gosh. All right. 
this oh, little back. dinette area turns into nine different configurations. Nine! So you can turn All right, it so they really have made the use of every space in yes. this, I will say that. The dinette is the other one. Oh, ah. so it literally is a porta potty. Yes, <laughs> yeah. All right, now moving on to the class C's. This is a very popular rig with the dog agility people. This is the Mini Winnie. This is the 322R. Today's show price is 99995 and it is a class C. So we'll go take a look at it. This is the really nice thing about a Mini Winnie. This one. Extra easy. dog storage space. Extra dog storage space. <laughs> Not for extra dogs, but all their staff. <laughs> and there's a dog touring there's it. There's a dog touring it. Yeah. All right. Ugh. All right, we have the bunk above the seating area again. Okay. Some here's nice up. plush seats down here. Oh, Still no. old school, old school uh, front end, but it's the. Well, this has Ford on it, but I thought it was a Mercedes chassis. No, not the Mini Winnie. Oh, okay. Ford, so this is going to be the Ford E, e Series. Yes. yes. Okay. So it's the same as the Thor. So we have a lovely booth here. Huge booth, actually. You can have lots of mates. Oops. How many Julies is it? Oh, it's like two and four Jacks. <laughs> two and four Jack Russells. Okay. Yeah. There's an accurate representation of units. Over here, we do have a tiny little oven with three burners, not hobs. See, I'm getting there, Lawrence. Oh, yeah. A microwave, fridge, definitely quite one, a big. Well, a, a big. one person shower unless you've got a really small other person. <laughs> that's cute. I like it. All right. And we've got. So that's your cheapest Class C in the Winnebago Good section. Dog show Good dog show vehicle. Good dog show vehicle. All right, we have an extra bonus feature for you because Julie does like the Airstreams. Everyone loves the Airstreams. So, we have sourced the most affordable Airstream. Not the cheapest, not the cheapest, the most affordable, because this sleeps six. So, and it's a bunkhouse. So this is the one they suggested to us. It's the Flying Cloud 30F BBT. Show price today, 119995. Let me show Just you the floor the plan. God, <laughs> <laughs> my legs. I'm in so much pain. This sleeps two Julies. I can tell you that already. <laughs> well, no, but there's a thing that goes between. So, oh, so it could be four could Julies. Be four Julies, all and right. Eight Jack Russells. Oh, that's, that's a big, that's a big And thing. we can watch television. <laughs> all right, we have a very cute little booth that folds down and sleeps. We have oh a chopping board slash kitchen uh, sink. That's how I like that. That's a good little. I like that sink. Yeah. Very nice. Three burners, covered. And it's got like the blue that. lights again. I'm I'm liking those blue like lights. That. Ooh, more sleeping bunks. Bunks for dogs. <laughs> yes. Loads of dogs. Loads in here. of dogs. <laughs> I could fill this with Jack Russell crates. <laughs> Lots of little crates all the way around. Yeah. And then I guess this the bathroom is behind you. Yep. Oh, right. that's not a bad shower. Not bad. Not a bad size. Check that out. Ha! Well, no slides, so obviously you are limited on space in the middle. Mm -hmm. But it's the silver bullet thing, right? I, I'm not allowed to say that, am I, Lawrence? Is it a silver? Uh, is that what they call it? No, that's like a. <clears throat> beep. I think it's a silver bullet. I don't know. Anyway, so for the airstreams, this is the oh, the top contender, the Flying Cloud 30 F B B T. Very nice. All right. So thank you to Lawrence's mum for dragging us back to the show <laughs> so that we could show you a lovely list of the most affordable not cheapest yes. the most affordable rigs that they have here obviously there's a million different brands so go ahead and have a look for other ones but we've we featured a handful but yes. we're a bit tired now we'd like to go get some food so we're going to end it there <laughs> if you like this video go ahead and like and subscribe if you want to join become a brazier and support a couple of tips you smack that join button and if you want to give us thanks that just sounds very strange the way I say that then you can hit the thanks button but otherwise we will see you next week Bye.